Welcome to our house. I am keep it reasonably tidy. We've got two housemates. I think it's important that the air is tidy, hassle free, stress free. It also has to reflect kind of like who we are and what we like. been in the, in the sunny coast for two years now and we have chosen a small bubble of Coolum Beach which for all our tri fans is halfway between the Noosa Tri and the Malulabar Tri. 15 minutes either way and like everyone probably went through our flat spot but now we are embracing home and exploring the new surrounds of Coolum Beach. We're lucky in Queensland, we have something like 350 square metres per person and we have a few short trails out the door, quite enough roads and the ocean temp doesn't dip below 20. The local fruit and veg store and coffee roastery is walking distance and fortunately for Zadie's energy levels an off-leash dog beach at the end of the street. Our lounge is basically our recovery space as well as a nice relaxing rest area. It does act as a gym. Zadie's a little troublemaker. She has a big shoe fetish and no qualms taking your slipper off your foot. We're working on teaching her to put her own toys away. We've managed to collect a few quirky mementos from around the world. Mostly posters to suit the standard triathlete luggage constraints, but a few pretty cool 3D art pieces too. So, running trail, we're lucky we've probably got an hour loop from our house in some of the bushland. Um, currently only one snake sighting and then if we're what there's definitely more than one snake sighting I've only seen one snake and I'm stoked about it <laughs> about 30 minutes we've got a huge array of trail runs We are pretty healthy eaters. Probably lucky to eat takeout once a month. I suppose we follow a vegetarian eating regime. Always up for new exciting recipes. Unfortunately, definitely still have a sweet tooth, but I try and have a constant healthy slice supply to curb the cookie cravings. Our outdoor 
to the dining room. We probably spend more time out here than inside. We're pretty lucky in the Sunshine Coast. I think we have an average per year of seven rainy days each month. Zadie likes us being out here. She's currently on a roll with her holes. Our attempt is chicken wire. It's averagely successful. Where the magic happens. We've currently got three triathletes in our household. So a constant rotation of huffing and puffing and turbo or fan hum. And a lot of storage boxes and hooks. Okay, we have a massive array of really awesome mountains around and have been taking the opportunity to get up a few of these lately. Normally with a backpack, 10 kgs worth, and if you don't have weights, some 1.5 kg soda water bottles wrapped in a towel works a treat. Underrated um, training session. The first time I did 90 minutes, which I think was about four repeats at Mount Coulomb. <laughs> getting, getting in and out of a chair was a workout in itself for the five days following. We come from over yonder, where the beaches squeak and the grass crackles. From where the bunyips grow and play, you'll need to go walk about to discover the land we lay. Glimpses of red crest flicker, while the cookies laugh, magpies swoop and the bin chickens bicker. Ocean's peak and trough over what was Coulomb's head. Mount Coulomb's shoulders stand strong and tall, casting a shadow over all. <laughs> 